the Mighty Squad. Whoo wee! Look at him. Check him out, YouTube. He look pretty damn hungry. Did you see one of my um, my partially white Midas turning white? Display bars every once in a while. Little male orange Midas. A few of them in here. One of them look like uh, Mr. Humpy Hump. Fish that Juan had. But all these orange Midas are his younger brothers anyway, so they should look like him. Some of them at least. Look as I raise my hand. See, I'm raising my hand and they all coming to the top. That's how I have them trained. If you, these are the fish facts. You can train your cichlids, especially when you breed them yourself and they're born and raised in your hatchery or your kennel. They're easy to train. Now I'm gonna feed these, these fish and show you how I train them. First, I turn on the light I keep the light on for a while so they can wake up and properly get acclimated to the lighting in the aquarium because it is 4.30 Friday morning, April 24, 2015. So it's early in the morning so it's dark outside. And of course when I turn on the light in the aquarium building, they got to get adjusted. And then I turn on the light in their aquarium, their eyes also have to get acclimated and adjusted to the light. Those are the fish facts. That's how you train your fish to not be shy and to come out in the open, especially when you have guests over to look at them or check them out. You want to make sure they're not shy. Now a lot of these young Midas, the bars and orange alike, have nice little humps on their heads. They're not huge yet, like they will be this summer when the weather and the temperature gets a lot warmer. See, a warm climate with other fish in the environment around Midas sort of entice their humps to go up. And it's a combination of things. It's a combination of their testosterone and estrogen levels getting high, getting ready to breathe. Hey Marco, check out that guy right there in the back. Right there. You know what that is. Off that female chancho. Matter of fact, both of them. that you gave me so let me get some food out to feed these guys we're gonna see what happens they ready too got to excuse me I'm trying to maneuver hold the camera and hold the food in my hand at the same time but as you can see here they come Look at them. Talk about a feeding video. Food is gone. That was a handful of pellets and gone in seconds. And how about that? How about smoke? <laughs> Proud Papa. Or soon to be Papa. They just laid eggs. Miss Pearl is showing her pearl colored bars which is an indication that eggs were laid and I see the eggs in the flower pot I showed, uh, well you guys can check out the video I'm gonna post it today 
And as I said in the video, as the due date for when the, for when the eggs supposed to hatch, her balls will get more and more intense. And when the fry starts swimming around, she'll show her intensity in her balls. That's her breeding dress, just like the pyro trimex or regular trimex. Some trimex show balls when they are uh, breeding. And that's a recessive trait. Those balls are recessive trait on Miss Pearl. That's why they don't always show consistently. They only show when she's breeding. So the skip, you know the saying.